Hi friends, today we're doing Unit 2, Lesson 13, Jane Goodall. First, let's go over the vocabulary that will be in today's reading. Primatologist, a scientist who studies primates. Primate, a mammal such as a monkey, ape, or human. Behavior, how a person or animal acts. Intelligent or smart. Activist, a person who strongly believes in changing something and works hard to try to make change happen. Chapter 14, Jane Goodall. Jane Goodall is a very famous primatologist. She is a scientist who studies a group of mammals called primates. Primates are a group of mammals that includes humans, monkeys, gorillas, and chimpanzees. Jane Goodall has spent her whole life studying chimpanzees. She has focused on studying animal behavior in chimpanzees. Her discoveries have made her one of the best known scientists in the world. Goodall was born in 1934 in London, England, when she was a little girl. Her, fav her father gave her a toy chimpanzee. It looked so real that people who visited her house were afraid of it, but she loved it. When Goodall was 23, she went to Africa. She began studying chimpanzees with a well-known scientist named Louis Leakey. After a year of working in Africa, Africa, Goodall went back to England and studied at the University of Cambridge. Can you guess what her favorite subject was? Chimpanzees. After finishing school, Goodall returned to Africa and spent the next 45 years studying chimpanzees in the wild. Her discoveries during those years completely changed the way people think about primates. Before Goodall's work, people thought chimpanzees were herbivores. She discovered that they eat meat too. More importantly, Goodall discovered that chimps were quite intelligent. She observed them making and using tools. Before that, people thought humans were the only animals that made and used tools. When you hear the word tool, you may think of a hammer, saw, or shovel. Chimps don't use those kind of tools. A tool is something used to help make a job easier. Tools can be very simple. A rock becomes a tool if you pick it up and use it to crack open a walnut. Goodall observed chimps using blades of grass and sticks as tools. Chimps like to eat termites, a type of insect that is like an ant. Termites live in holes underground. To catch these tasty insects, Goodall observed chimps sticking a blade of grass into a termite hole. The termites crawled onto the grass. Then the chimp took the grass out of the hole and ate the termites. Before Goodall wrote about this behavior, people did not realize how clever chimps and other primates are. Goodall gave names to all the chimps in the group she was studying. She got to know them pretty well. Over time, she learned that chimps were smart animals. She learned that chimps express many of the same feelings as people. They can feel happy, sad, and mad. Chimps can also be mean. Goodall saw them attack and eat small monkeys, not out of hunger, but because they didn't want them around. Goodall is more than a scientist. She is also an activist. An activist is someone who works hard to solve a problem and change something in the world. Goodall works as an animal rights activist to protect chim chimpanzees and their habitats. She tells others about human damage to habitats, such as hunting and pollution, and works to stop these problems. She loves working with young people and teaching them how to protect animals. She has written many books and has been the subject of books and movies. She has won many awards for her work in protecting chimpanzees. As of 2015, she was 81 years old and still working to spread the message that animals need to be protected. You may now move on to Unit 2, Lesson 13, Google Form.